Hey, what's up, friends? Moses here from Driver Success. I hope and pray that you guys are doing well. So today I'm here um, on the website. Uh, JB Hunt has what we call the transfer portal, right? The transfer portal is where we go to... Uh, if you wanted to make like a change within the company and see what positions are out there that you may want to uh, to take advantage of, you can. So sometimes, um, for example, I'm with the intermodal department. Uh, there may be some other thing out there that could be paying more than what I currently have. Usually like dedicated accounts, you'll find some dedicated accounts that are good that maybe pay more. So what I'm doing right now is I want to make some changes. We want to make some changes. So um, one of the things I've said about tracking that I really, really love is that you can have some flexibility concerning your career. You can be able to change uh, certain areas or certain things within your career. For example, um, moving, right? When I moved from California, came to Texas, I didn't have to worry about a job because I knew, because I knew that my driving record was good, I knew I could be able to get a job when I moved. So it's not something that I was worried about. Um, now, when you are with a bigger com company like JB Hunt, you could even move within the company and just transfer to your new location and still work with the same company. When I moved from California, the company I was working with in California was a smaller company, so they didn't have any locations in Texas. So I couldn't transfer within the company, but when I came here, I knew I would easily get a job, and that was true. Thank God for that. So that, that's one of the things that you can do. The other thing you can do is you have this opportunity to, to do different things. For example, right now I'm doing intermodal, but if I wanted to, I could go and do maybe like um, whole fuel. I could go and do flatbed. I could go and do whole cars. Like you have this flexibility of doing something within the trucking industry, depending on what your needs are. And so for us, uh, the other thing that you can also do is you can decide to stay as a local driver, or you can go over the road, or you can go as a regional driver. Again, depending on your needs, you can kind of change around from time to time to meet those needs. So for us in the past, um, when I, before I got married, I was doing regional runs. Uh, actually, it was a mixture of regional and local work with the company I was with. As soon as I got married, I told my manager that I could. I didn't want to go regional anymore. I just wanted to stay as a local driver because I was married. And, of course, when even the kids came, that even made it more like solid. I could only be a local driver. And so thankfully, uh, my manager gave me that opportunity. So from the time I got married, uh, I've been doing local work. Uh, it was important for us uh, that I am home every single day uh, so that our daughters can always see mommy and daddy home every day. But now we are, uh, now, one of the things that happens is when that happens, there are sacrifices, like in trucking, there are sacrifices you have to make. Sometimes you have to make, you have to decide whether you prefer the home time you either sacrifice the home time or you sacrifice the pay. Like there is sometimes, uh, most times that is the sacrifice you make. You either sacrifice the pay so you can be home more often or you sacrifice the home time so that you can uh, get a higher pay. So we are in that process right now, and I'll give you more details later on, but we are in that process of making some changes. And so I'm looking through here uh, to see what opportunities are out there uh, within JB Hunt uh, to see if there's something that really catches my attention. So I don't know if it's going to be a local position or a regional position. I'm just seeing if I can find something that gets my attention. So far, I don't... Um, I haven't seen something that really, uh, at least within 
my area that has got my attention. But I just wanted to kind of um, share with you that, that there, uh, I'm planning to make some changes. I'm planning to make some changes. Now, how those changes go and where they take me, I don't know, but the process is to see how to make those changes. So uh, I thought I would just let you know uh, so you guys can know what to expect. Uh, I will, I'll be filling you. Uh, I'll be filling you in as the process works out. Look at this. This is in Waxahachie, which is really far from me. It's you are home daily, but the the average is between seventy two and ninety. What is this about? Okay, this is ten ten stops per week. Each stop is paid at twenty six fifty, twenty trip dead. But what do you do? Oh, flat bed experience. Minimum three months recent flat bed experience. I don't have flat bed experience. But this right here, the average is seventy two thousand. Uh, well, they I don't know. And you have to be on a waiting list, so it's not even available. Anyway, I will uh, I just wanted to kind of give you an update on that. I'm just going to continue to see what's available. And then I will keep them coming so you guys know what I'm working on. All right, friends, until then, stay blessed and stay safe. Bye-bye.